決めたあいつの技は先に登録してなかった隠して This video is sponsored by Card Market, Europe's largest online marketplace for trading card games. This video is sponsored by Sleeve Chief. There's a major restock coming for a lot of their popular sleeves, and they're going to be releasing a new Enol, Dawn Sleeve, and Hollow Sleeve as well. Use code CARDKAIZOKU for an additional 5% off your order. So, this is my current 07 Luchi list, and here's the rank that the matches in this video are played around at. If it matters to you, I actually haven't been playing too much recently, so my ranked drop a little bit, but it's still quite high. I'm testing out Tenkos Kuzan. I, I didn't like the e shows, I took them out. I felt like I really didn't need it against Black Yellow Luffy. I found out a way to play against him that bypasses it. I have like three really good Black Yellow Luffy games that I could have put in this video, but I screwed up the recording. I recorded the wrong screen, so I only have the audio. So sorry about that. I'll, I'll try to get that matchup posted sometime this week if I can find any Bumblebee Luffy's I can play against. But yeah, I felt like Isho was not needed for that matchup anymore. In the mirror, I felt like, well, as I climbed higher, I felt like Isho was like more detrimental than he was helpful. Because I'd rather play an 8-drop that can handle their 8-drop instead of playing the Isho that they can answer. And then I have nothing else after that. Right, in the Luchi mirror, your Isho's like 90% of the time never live. So I just decided to take him out in favor of Kuzan, who... With our leader in any's lobby, can KO, can answer your opponent's 8 drop. And then since he's a 10 cost, it's hard for your opponent to answer back. So that's why I, I wanted to try him out. But also in the games in this video, I, I didn't really get a chance to, <laughs> to show that. There were Luchi mirrors where I, I could have gone for it, but it was much better to go for like a Sabo play instead and like stay mid range. Unfortunately, but I think there's still merit to it. I'll, I'll have to experiment with it more. But yeah, despite that, these are still good games that I thought I should include in a video. And yeah, one thing I realized is that the higher I climb on the rank ladder, like, I can't really win with any other deck besides meta. So if you want, like, really high-ranking ranked footage, I have to play Luchi or something. So if you're looking for off-meta, I don't know, do I just make a new account or something and start at low elo, or do I just play unranked? I don't know. I'll figure that out myself. But yeah, enjoy the games. We have Luchi versus Red Purple Law. Uh, yeah, no stage, but everything else in the hand is pretty good. We'll cycle out. Oh, we get the stage. Perfect. Perfect hand. And two down, they don't do anything. That gives us the perfect chance to play stage and set up our discard. So we have cards for Luchi. We'll pass. Whatever they play, I will kill. Mr. Two, six at us. We'll take that. And Mr. Two, I will kill. Do five at them, minus one, Mr. Two. Too many numbers, Mr. Two, Mr. One, Mr. Gotta get it done. Okay, stage. Play Spandam. And I have to discard these three cards. Gekko Morian, no. I guess I could play Brook instead. Play Brook instead. We'll save Luchi for when they have two characters out. That's better, I think. Well, at least our discard's almost at 10. Let's see, we're on odd curve, so a little awkward for us. Queen, I I can kill one queen, but no second character. If I had eight Dawn, maybe I could with Khalifa, but I don't got it. Oh, Brook gives me one cost. Does that make a difference? No, it doesn't. They're probably going to bottom deck him too, with the Gordon Reese Max. Nope, they don't. Seven at me, we'll take that. Sudo, okay. Uh, hmm. They bottom deck our Spandaman and play the Shachi Pangolin. Okay, so I can make him a 2 cost and I can make him a three cost, a 1 cost. That's enough for Luchi. But I do have to give up... Let's see, I have 3 Dawn to spare. Now I can attack for 6, right? So 6. Minus 1 to the Queen. They block. Counter 1, that's fine. Minus 2 cost. And then... I do Brook. Wait. Yeah, there, yeah. <laughs> I, I confused myself for a second. Minus one cost to Shashi Penguin. And then Sudo. That's the part, piece I was missing, but I saw it in my hand. I just didn't verbalize it, and that that like feedback loop confused me. They countered that for 1k as well. Sudo, and then Luchi. 
Gecko, Tempest Stage, Kill Kill, pass. Then we have Sabo from next turn and then Kuzan after, if he doesn't flood it too much. And once I have Kuzan out, Luchi can kill anything on board. 6k at Brook, sure. Miss all Sunder. And then raise max, bottom deck my Luch. Yeah, no matter what he plays off of his leader ability, I can kill both with Sabo, at least. So he'll still be like, board, clear, clear of board, clear of characters, clear of conscience. Oh, no bottom deck on my Luchi, that's good too. So, uh, Ayn. Okay, I think 6Ks are devastating to him, so we'll keep doing that. Here's a 6. Minus 1 cost to Ayn. Where are my reducers, he says. It happens. I need my cost reducers, he needs his power reducers, he took that. Okay, Luchi 6. Counter 2 with 1k counters, that's good. We'll play Sabo. I don't think I need Hamapo anymore, so kill these two. Pass. Normally I'd respond to people who like type with when they do like fun banter, but I'm just so tired. I don't know if I say this in an earlier match, but I, I recorded for like 2 hours earlier and then it was all footage I couldn't use because I was recording the wrong screen, so I'm like really bummed out. But trying to power through it and I eat dinner too, so I'm like food comboing right now pretty hard. And it's affecting my play, but I guess this matchup is something I'm used to, so I'm not having to use too much brain power here. It, it's like the uncommon matchups like freaking Boa and Perona. Those I have to use a lot of brain power because I'm not used to the lines of play. But if it's like Enel, the mirror. Red Purple Law, Enel. Oh, I said Enel twice. That's how like brain fogged I am. But yeah, those I usually autopilot. Okay, five at me. Well, counter two. Because I'm scared of rush. High cost kid. And there's a power reducer. Here, I'll type something to be nice. Ooh, and rage you too. Uh-oh, if he swarms like this, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if I... Oh, wait. Sabo means I win. Does it? So we'll get rid of Kid and Mr. Two. Sabo trash, kill kill. Leader seven and then Sabo nine, hopefully. He did have counter for that, so nine from my Sabo. So he has to kill me this turn. Hey, conceded. Okay, we got it. Bye. We have Luchi versus Red Purple Law. Uh, mulligan. Yeah, yeah, this is good. We'll spandam into Luchi. Oh, even better. Just need the stage card now. Okay, three down play, nothing. So we'll do five from lead. They took that. Okay, how about five from spandam? Would have liked to get a stage there, but can't have everything, right? Okay, they counter 1k. So he plays a 4 drop here, 5 at my Spandam. Mr. 2. I don't have enough cost reduction to kill him. <laughs> oh no. Oh, I guess I could use Kaku. I don't have. Oh, yeah, yeah 2 Spandams is enough. Okay. Woo! Lucky, lucky. So 5 minus 1 cost, they counter, we'll play Kaku. Return, return, kill with the 2 only CP cards in our discard because we milled the Sabo and a Gecko, so sad. Okay, if I cost kid, I can get rid of that. Raise max my Kaku, that gets rid of him. Oh wait, I can kill with Brook. Thank you, Brook. Okay, seven of us, we finally take Sabo. Ooh, we get stage. Does that change anything? I guess I could Luchi instead of Brook. Yeah, yeah. Do I Luchi then? Don leader attack six. I think it's better to develop the stage card this turn if I can. Okay, so they block counter one. And he's lobby minus two. Then we'll play Luchi. Return three. KO only kid, unfortunately, and pass. Okay, there's a queen. I do need like a up end right now, 8 cost, something 8 cost, Sabo would be sweet. Gecko, not as sweet because I don't have anything in the discard. Oh, I guess Brook. Yeah, give me 8 cost Sabo, please. 
So what does Queen find them? Okay, so raid you five. We should counter that. Because the leader leader's gonna swing for seven. So just six. Uh whoa. He's got a bottom deck, right? I will counter that too then. Hmm, I don't know. Maybe I should have kept one of the Khalifas, because I could play it next turn. To give minus two cost to something. Okay, Mr. Two. We top deck a Khalifa anyway, so it all worked out. So minus three. Yeah. We could kill Mr. Two and the Reiju, but not Queen. But I want to kill Queen. How do we do this? Okay, I can Brook the Queen. And then Reiju I kill with the other Brook somehow. Does that work out? I think we do five at this. We can kill Mr. Two. Oh, I was supposed to minus one cost the queen. Does this still work out? Wait, I messed up somewhere. <laughs> okay, we'll just kill the two four cost because that that's what we originally accounted for. In which case, I should have put it down on my leader, but I messed up somewhere there. So, Khalifa. We do get access to Tempest Kick now. That does change things. Yeah, we'll kill Queen instead. Right, because Queen is a... Whatever cost right now. Yeah, yeah, we'll kill Queen. Let's play Luchi. Return, 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 kill, kill. Pass. Okay, Raju 5 at us. I guess we'll... We'll counter 1. Another queen out. Does he have a raise max Gordon? Because I am out of answers. Nope, six at us. Great, we'll take that. Ten cost Kuzan, that is a great answer. We'll play Kuzan, kill queen. We'll do five at Reiju. We counter one. Okay, six at Reiju. Give me a 2k. Sure, we'll pass. Just gotta survive. Sabo will help me find an answer next turn, hopefully. Okay, five at me, we'll counter one. Yeah, okay, we'll counter one. I think I just have to be safe. Even though, like, Brook could kill Reju <laughs> on his own. I can just attack in there. Okay, they have a five drop they're gonna play. Seven at my Luchi, I actually can't defend that if they go for that. Seven at me, we'll take that. Okay, Luchi kills any two things he plays. So here's Gordon. Bottom decks my Luchi into Kid and Killer. Seven at me will take two Luchis. Another Kid and Killer. Ooh, this is bad. We have to take that. All right, I have to blocker and then Luchi. Because I can't kill him, so we'll do five at Kid and Killer. And then Luchi to kill the other two. Then I need counter. So Khalifa 5, they take... There's a chance he could get Kidding Killers if I attack too much. So maybe I just play Sabo here. Ooh, that's kind of rough. Get rid of the two stages. Hmm, I think I pass. Yeah, I can, like, I can just kill him the turn after if he doesn't draw like two rush cards right now. I could get like a bunch of blockers right now though. I'm just decreasing the likelihood of him finding his like third kidding killer. Oh, fourth kidding killer. I should have checked his trash. He only has one left. And at me will block. He gets rid of my Luchi, maybe. Otama gets rid of my Khalifa, but that's fine. I think I have enough still. Oh, they have a blocker. Okay, that changes things. Not really. Because we'll play Luchi. KO both. Boom, boom. Five that lead. And then seven, and then yeah, we got it. <laughs> Whew. That was scary. If he had, if he runs like two Zoros and a hidden killer, I just didn't want to risk it. But yeah, being safe is the best. Okay, bye. We have a Luchi mirror right after I ate a big dinner. Let's see how horrible this goes. 
Okay, that's a horrible hand to go with my horrible mind state right now. Uh, well, Tempest Kick, pass. Ooh, Kuzan. I need the stage though to utilize it against the mirror. I want to show you guys why I put it in the deck, put it in the deck, but the matches where I can get to use it, I don't get the cards I need. So Spandam. And we completely whiff and we lose a Gecko. So Luchi, seven. He lost a stage two, so I feel a little better. They took. Okay, we're at six cards, discard. They could do Khalifa, five at lead. Here's five at lead. I'll take one. Oh, I get the stage. Okay, I can show you why I put the Kuzan in this deck. And why I think it's better than Isho. Okay, they do play Khalifa in the end. I guess I could answer with my own Khalifa, or I just kill it with Kaku. Kill it with Kindness in the form of Kaku. Oh, Kaku's blonde? I didn't know that. I thought he had like... Wait, I never paid attention to what color his hair was. Oh, I could do Luchi. Luchi better, I think. Kills two bodies. So here's six. They took Lobby, Luchi. Return, return, return. Kill, kill. Pass. Let's see. He answers. Okay, five at me. I don't want to go to three like he is. So we'll counter one. Two, I mean. They play Brook to kill our Luchi. Uh, I can kill the Brook and that's it. I mean, what more could I ask for? <laughs> so we'll get into three costs here. So leader seven, they counter three. Stage. Kaku. Return these two. Kill Brook. Pass. Okay, now we'll take a life. He's gonna play a cost. No, he doesn't have it. Six at me, we'll take. Got a Sabo. Okay, they finally get the stage. They're gonna play their own Sabo. Or their own Kaku. Their own Kaku. Okay, I have to Rebecca Spandine to kill Kaku here. Do I have the CP needed? Let's see. We'll do five from Spandam, right? If I do Rebecca, I can do Rebecca Sabo. In fact, I should play Sabo first to fill my discard. Let's see. I have 3 CP and I can play out Luchi. Then I need 3 cards after that. So leader attacks first for 5. Okay, I think I, I don't need to play Sabo first. With this configuration. They took Lobby. Play Rebecca into Spandine. Play him out. Return you, you, and you. Bring back Luchi. Return you, you, and you. Kill Kaku. Then we'll play Sabo to keep our board from being KO'd. Uh, dang, I want to use Kuzan, but I don't think I will get the chance to. We'll get rid of these two. I think Sabo is too important not to have in hand. So we'll get rid of 4k counter. So yeah, his 8 cost Kakomori play is not going to do anything to this board. So he'll just have to develop like blockers and stuff. Which he does not have. So this is a, I think a big tempo swing for me. And he's at 2 life too. So he has like a little bit less wiggle room. To defend himself. Hmm. So if I prevent him from playing an 8 cost. Then I don't get to show you why Kuzan is in the deck. <laughs> we'll see, we'll see. Maybe I'll still get a chance. But yeah, if he, if he just plays out two five costs, I'll just swing with my board, play another Sabo, keep it immune. Okay, he does play Sabo, so I'm not going to play my big guys either. We're keeping it mid-range. Yep, he's discarding his top end too. He's probably got another Sabo in hand. The five cost one, I mean. And luckily, we kept ours. Do I have, I have one more in my deck? Yeah, I do. Six at our Luchi. We'll counter two. They play Borsa. Yep. Blocker battle. Okay, so it's five down for Sabo. I should probably play it first. Yeah, I will play it first so that his triggers can't kill anything on my board. Replace we'll Spandam. I think I have to drop you, Kuzan. Sorry. And then Luchi too. Okay, we'll do six from Luchi. We do six Ks all around, it seems like. To get around their six K blockers. They counter two, so we'll do six from our lead. It took about six from Spendine. It took six from Sabo. 
block counter one, probably. Oh, he just blocks no counter? So it all it's all eight drops. I can't help him at this moment because I'm immune to KO. Yeah, Sabo like makes or breaks this mirror match. And then the fact that I, I went for it instead of playing an 8-drop makes it awkward for him, so he can't start playing his 8-drops either. And luckily I just had the math to like KO their board with the spending. Yeah, the food is wearing off, my brain's starting to work again. Another Sabo. Yep, a lot of non-counter cards I had to get rid of. And I have 4k, so hopefully I can keep my board safe. He might play like a Rebecca here, and then swing 6-6. Like, throws out the GG, we got it. It was all non-counter, so yeah, we would have won swinging at him. Nice, okay, bye. Luchi Mirror. Uh, if I can get a stage, I could show you Tenkos Kuzan. That's Mulligan. Okay, we'll play Tempest Kick. Two Sabos, eh? Hmm, and we're odd curve. We might lose this one. Just from our opening hand. Oh, okay, never mind. Maybe we'll win this one. <laughs> My uh, opinions can change that quickly. Oh, they run Ice Age. Okay, that's a good thing to note. They took our 8. We lost one of our Tenkos Kuzan, so I can't show you the secret tech. Five at me, we'll take that one. Ooh, another Sabo. Maybe we win, we win just based off of our late game. 6 from this guy. Ooh. I kind of have to take this. I should have just countered the leader. Dang it. Ooh, another Ikaz Kekamoria. Oh my god. We're like drawing nuts. I think I can afford to play this next turn. So 5 at Spandam. And then Sabo. Um, so Rebecca. And then. I guess I don't need Brook. We'll pass. Maybe I'll need him later. I could always bring it back with Rebecca. But yeah, we're at 7 next turn, so it's another Sabo and then uh, Annie's Lobby, maybe? Okay, 7 at us. Dang it, I don't have a 2k, so we'll have to block with Sabo. I play Khalifa. Khalifa alone. Maybe I could have blocked and countered with the Spandam and then a Kaku. That would have worked, but I'm going to kill the Khalifa this turn. So, lobby, minus two, five at lead, minus one. They do counter. We'll play Kaku, kill, and pass. And then next turn, we could Sabo or Gecko. They could Isho us right now. We'll lose two things here, unless they give us a chance to counter. I could over counter to be safe. Uh... Yeah, why not? Yeah, he had the Isho. <laughs> I'm glad we overcountered there. Nice. And then I just kill Isho, and then they don't get any benefit. So, uh, 5 from lead. Minus 1 to Isho. Let's see, what KO do I have? Do I have Luchi? I don't even have Luchi, so I have to use Sabo. Unfortunate. Lobby. Kaku, 7. He dies, we'll play Sabo, Trash, Sudo, kill Isho, pass. Not a single Luchi, what the heck? It's gonna make killing his Gekko Morias to turn after, kinda awkward. Five at us. Dang it. I think we have to counter. So he doesn't have stage too, that's good. But he does run Ice Age. And Hina, what the heck? A lot of big cost reduction here. But yeah, I lost my Sabos, I kind of need it. So if he, doesn't, if he doesn't develop a threat, I'll play Gecko into... Okay, never mind. <laughs> I have to kill that guy. And he did get the uh, stage in the end, so that kills my Sabo. I do need my own... Uh, freaking... Luchi. At some point. Or else I'm going to have to play Sabo right now. Khalifa. Alright, we'll do 5 at lead, minus 1 to Gecko. Did I get him? Nope. Okay, so it's a Sabo. Sabo play. Minus two to Gecko. I guess I'll get rid of the Khalifa. I would like to kill the Luchi too, but it looks like I can't. He has another Helm Uppo anyway, so yeah. 
Sabo, discard Khalifa, kill these two. We'll do eight at lead. We take, we'll pass. Let's hope they're out of eight costs so I can get uh, my advantage of keeping these two non-counter cards in hand. <laughs> okay, so minus two to Kaku. Ran Kaku on my Sabo, oh no. He has a Sabo. And then five, seven, I cannot defend either. I'm gonna take two hits right now. No! It's all falling apart. Ten Kaskus on, no! Seven from Luchi. Hmm. Now I get the freaking Luchi. Okay, if I can kill this Luchi with the 7k, maybe I'll be saved. He countered two, so I'm not saved at all. Uh, if I 10 cost Kuzan, I can kill him and then he just kills me after. So I can't do that. So if I 8 cost Kako, I can only bring back Rebecca as a defensive option. And then can I KO anything? I have Brook. I guess I killed Aluchi. Minus 2 to Luchi. Play A cost Kakomoria. So Rebecca and then Sudu. Sudu onto Luch. And Luch. Oh, uh, Rebecca bring out Brook. Where's the Brook? Here. <laughs> Brook out. Kill Luchi. Pass. Dang. That's such a weak play, all because I didn't have a Luchi until now. If they can just KO Rebecca, they can attack into me and kill me right now. So I can't show you my tech. If I had gotten this 10 cost Kuzan earlier to answer one of his 8 drops, he'd be a lot more useful right now. It's just at this moment, I do need to play like the 8 drop that can bring me, bring me out a blocker. Also, that turn where he hit me for 5 and 7, I couldn't do anything about it. That was really detrimental. My own hubris. Maybe we could still pull it off. Maybe he don't got it. Maybe he realized if he can't finish me this turn, he has to clear my bodies instead. So I'll stay at one life. Because yeah, I threaten lethal, if not. Right, Brook can be an attacker, and then I have leader, and then Gecko. If I had Helmepo instead of Sudu, that might be a little scarier too, but I didn't have him either. Just unfortunate we mill like 20 cards, but... <laughs> Barely any of the cards that we could use. So the other half of our deck should be great, right? Okay, they're swinging 5 at Brook. This is good news. Minus 1 cost to Gecko. Is it good news? That means I'm not going to be able to finish turn the turn after either. So that's minus 3 cost on to Gecko. Line at me will block. And I can't get this Luchi out of my hand either. Okay, they played Brook to give him minus 4 cost, so he's a 4 drop, and they played this Brook to kill it. Got it. So I can't finish with 2 bodies. I can't even hit him. Hmm. It's a Brook angle again. Right, because even if I kill these 2, he has 2 bodies to kill me and I don't have a blocker, so I have to play Gakumoria here. Should I play Spandam out to find something? There's nothing he can find me. Or maybe Tempest Kick? We'll play him out. Nope. Pick a Khalifa though. Down leader. Swing 6 at him. I guess we kill the Brook. We take... Minus 2 to Brook. Play Gecko into... Rebecca. And a... Spandam. Find me something. Another 2k, that's good. Then Brook back out. Play Sudu, kill Brook. And then try to survive this at least. I got rid of their KO outlet. Right, if he had one last turn, he would have killed me, so I'm, I'm guessing he doesn't have another way to KO. And we have 6k counter this time. Okay, the Tempest Kick are Gecko. I gotta use these Spandams to, to maybe <laughs> win me the game here. Okay, so Brook 7, we counter. Maybe I should have just blocked with Rebecca. No, I can't defend his uh, any other hits. So Gecko's a 5. 
and then now he's at two cost. We'll counter the five. Huh. Oh, he's gonna play a Sabo here. No, he attacks with Sabo. We'll block. I have a feeling we're gonna win off the Spandam. We're all like playing on fumes right here. This would be an inter interesting game to post <laughs> if I do win it. Oh, even if I lose it. I'm just making do with the poop I've been given. But it looks like he is too. So he's prepping up for an 8 drop, right? Gecko's at 2 cost. He can kill Gecko and the Spandam with the Luchi, but he needs like uh, something else that can give cost reduction for 4. Or he's thinking of playing Sabo, right? The 5 cost Sabo. Make everything immune to KO and then block her up. But then he would have split his Dawn differently. Yeah, there's no way to know what he's thinking. Hell, I don't even know what I'm thinking half the time. I probably I probably brought it, brought it up a couple times in my other videos, matches in this video, but I had like two hours of footage I recorded that I can't use. I have the audio of it, just no like video. 10 games worth of footage, I don't know what I, I'm going to do with it. Because they were pretty good games, I had the audio. Should I just like reenact them? Okay, did you play Eikos Kekomoria? Uh, so Helmapo Luchi? What is this kill? Oh, they played the Helmapo active by accident. Okay, so they killed these two. I'm gonna finish them with the Spandams. Nice. 577. Seven, seven. Okay, let's see. Let's see if it works out for us. Five atom. Is it better to have split half and half? Maybe I lose. Maybe I should have done like... Uh, what am I thinking there? My, my brain's not working. What's 17 divided by 2? 13? No, wait. 17 divided by 2. 8,000, 9,000. <laughs> we'll do it this way. So, 7. If we counter this, I lose. He okay, took... Good luck to me. Here's a 7 from Spandam. Oh! <laughs> Dang, he just needed 1k counter. Okay, we ended up winning that somehow. So this one's being posted. Okay, bye. Well, I post even the ones I lose to. You guys know that. Bye.